My name is Sage. I moved to Atlanta in September of last year, September 2022. So I've been here like half a year. My home is probably my favorite place right now. I have a really beautiful backyard and from like there, I've been like going on different trips around Snellville to see like the beautiful nature places. So there's this whole waterfall, Hiawassee Falls, which I saw recently that was so beautiful. And I went to the Chattahoochee River and it was so gorgeous and we're gonna float the river. So mainly like a lot of the like nature spots is what I've been able to see, which has been really beautiful. Yeah. What's lighting your heart up right now? Honestly, in this moment, you. <laughs> yeah, just meeting people that are genuine and like open for connection and to really see me because I love to like really connect with people. So it feels really good to have someone genuinely interested in seeing and asking these kind of questions. <laughs> yeah, it's great to get to know people. Yeah. What's one of your favorite ways to express yourself? I love to create so like I love just music making music is one of my favorite ways to express myself my partner is produces music so we make music together and I sing I also love to dance I love to like ecstatic dance so there's like this thing this is called soul dance and they do ecstatic dances and so it's just like one of my favorite ways to express myself is to move freely and I love art. I love like making abstract things, like line art, just like I love. Self-expression is one of my values and my like most important things in life. It's like self-expression through creation. Yeah. Love it. And what does love mean to you? <laughs> <laughs> love means, first of all, it's a feeling. Feel it in your body and it makes you want to cry and it makes you want to laugh and it makes you want to hug someone and it makes you get really inspired and creative with ideas of how you can do things for the people around you that you feel love for. Love is like joy and peace at the same time. Like so full and rich. <laughs> if you could, if you could give yourself ten years ago some advice, what would that advice be? Oof. Follow your heart. Follow the thing you are most excited about. Travel. If someone invites you to do something and it feels like a yes and you're excited about it, that's a yes. Do that thing. Continue to follow those things. You'll have the best life ever. And if you were to imagine what your future self would say that's 10 years older than you, what would they say to you right now? <laughs> the same thing. Probably the same thing. Keep making music. Believe in yourself. You're doing amazing you're on the right path. You're always on the right path. You don't have to doubt yourself. Give people more surprises, like presents. Write them love notes. Leave them love notes. Love the people around you. And what do you want your legacy to be? Define legacy, like just what I'm known for. Like what I leave behind. What you leave behind, what people think of or feel when they think of you. She always did what made herself happy and it lit up the world and inspired people to be in their joy and in their love. Thank you so much for sharing. <laughs> yeah.